All right, it is Saturday, July 30th, and I had the most blessed opportunity today to go to Calvary Church here in Orlando. Uh, there was a big life surge uh, convention going on. It was a business slash Christian convention, and I got to see Tim Tebow. It's the first time I've ever seen that guy speak publicly, and I love Tebow. He's one of the most amazing guys that's alive on this earth. And I've got a, just a short clip here from what I saw. It's about three minutes long, and it uh, is a great salvation message from Tebow. Um, hopefully someday I'll be able to talk to this guy personally, uh, but it was a huge blessing to be able to meet him. Um, the significance with him is, is just amazing. The guy has the exact same birthday as my son, Joseph, born on the same day, exactly 20 years apart. I feel like this guy has a supernatural anointing upon him to be used in a powerful way in these times that we're in. And so you're gonna love this video. Thank you that I got to finally meet this guy. God's never had an oops moment and it didn't start with any of us. So ultimately, why would you ever have confidence if you think oh, I'm just here by happenstance? Why would you ever have confidence if you're like, man, I, I might just be an accident. Why would you ever have confidence if you're like, man, I don't even like how I was created. I wish I looked like that person. I wish I was taller like that person. I wish I had that ability. You know, sometimes I did too. I watched someone else and I'm like, dang, I wish I could throw like that. I wish I was that fast. I wish I could do that. But you know what? I'm not actually jealous or envious or mad at that person. What I'm really saying to God is, you messed up on me. I should have been more like that person. And God didn't mess up on you. You were one of one. Created in love, by love, and for love. God did not mess up on you. For you to actually walk with confidence in your life, you need to understand how valuable you are. How, how, how do we know how valuable something is? by what someone's willing to pay. Dang, that means your life is infinitely valuable. Why? Because someone who has infinite value in the Son of God died for you to have life. That means your life has infinite value. We're going to have obstacles, but we can take part. Why? 